In this video, I'm going to show you the breakout strategy based on the linear regression. So guys, I'm going to talk about the different linear reg regression channel in this video. So please make sure that you are going to uh, watch the full video. Otherwise, you will be going to skip the important part of this video anytime. Okay, so before I start this video, let me introduce myself. I'm a price action coach and I have a special uh, one hour coaching program. You can book your one hour coaching session with me. Please find the link of the telegram channel in the description of this video below. Moreover, subscribers, if you are willing to join the best broker that I personally use and this broker allows you a variety of trading accounts as you can see on the screen. So you can join this broker. I have given this link in the description of this video below. Okay, guys, uh, now let's uh, move toward the indicator section and we are going to add the indicator. We need to write linear regression and we will write channel. So once we will write a linear regression channel, then uh, you know that there are a lot of indicators with this, but we are going to use the one that says slash curve slash slope by digity. Okay. So uh, you know that I, I think Digity has the another indicator for the linear regression as well, but we are not going to use that one. We are only going to use linear regression channel slash curve slash slope by Digity and 3,853 traders are using it. Okay, now I'm, I have clicked this indicator. So let's see how it get attached on our chart. Okay, so guys, uh, uh, this is kind of a uh, th these are the levels that it has already dra drawn like you can talk about the you know the very well about the Fibonacci levels and also there is a moving average inside it so you can play uh, with this as well so this is kind of a different uh, uh, with a different approach otherwise you know that linear regression are uh, there are a lot of indicators on trading view they are giving the concepts of the linear regression but I found it useful due to its moving average factor and the second thing that uh, it has a pretty look as well and the uh, the levels that are uh, given in that indicator are pretty uh, much uh, valuable than the other ones okay so for example so guys uh, if you look at here so until unless the, uh, the market does not break that level and come inside the moving average factor that it uh, comes above the moving average it means that something is happening bullish in the market however uh, we are into the downward trend but it means that that was a reversal point so you can see that the market break the next level and it also break the next level and the market flow down or flow up and later on you can see uh, that it comes below the moving average and then you can see things were changing changing and this level get a breakout and that was your selling chance and you can see the next level get a break the market even went down later on again the market decided to push up and guys you can see that these the on the breakout of each level like the Fibonacci the things are working very clearly I mean you will not be very much confused with your trading that what to do with the trade what not to do so this is not a confused indicator because if you for example if you just look at the five minute picture you can see the candle retraced back from the st1 r level and you can see that was the downward breakout you can see and the next candle is also pumping down so there are some chances that the market can flow further into the downward direction so this is how you can utilize this indicator because this indicator is working very good okay so overall a slow momentum but you can see below the uh, moving average uh, uh, you need to look for the downward breakouts above the moving average you should be looking towards the upper breakouts because this could be a healthy approach towards the trading okay however if you look at here now you can see that the uh, the candles comes above the moving average so for example if this level get a breakout so get a chance i mean try the your opportunity till the next level if it get a break till the next level okay so this is how you need to work because this indicator is found to be very uh, with a very positive approach and the levels are really working and you can also practice this thing on a demo account uh, this is not a financial advice however if you are going to choose any strategy from the channel then it's your duty to first practice on the demo account and if you find it to be profitable as well at your end then you can apply the same strategy on your trading account so this is all about the today's strategy but uh, guys what do you think about the today's strategy let me know into the comment section moreover please subscribe fx mentor us like the videos share the videos and thank you very much for watching this video